meant to meant to go to let's see. The other thing that you'll see and show useless use of cats. <laughs> use of cat award. Yeah. A lot of times you'll see that sort of thing where people will will cat a file into grep and grep can clearly take the file. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, like, your into, uh, like I did, yeah. Exactly. Like I did that. I was trying to find a, program, a, a way to yeah. use a file, but yeah. yeah. File into more. Uh huh. Um, yeah. yeah. So that's about all I've got. Um, anybody have any questions? Generally, it, it's got its place. Shell has its place. Um, it. There are prettier languages, and and Shell yeah. is full yeah. of gotchas in a lot of ways, but it, it does accomplish certain needs. And, yeah. and for cases where it's sitting between you and the and a failing machine or a failing node, it's nice. Mm -hmm. What's up? I love Shell programming. Thanks for showing this. Yeah. Um, I see your slides. Are your slides and your examples up on your GitHub account, or just the uh, slide side? Um, the everything's there. Yeah, yeah, everything's there. So, yeah, I mean, if you that's probably enough. Yeah. Well, that's my OSC dog. For, yeah. If you look at my GitHub, you can find it, and then I, I'll get them to the so they can get on the website there too. But. Avoiding dangers. Huh? Avoiding dangers of Avoid. shell program. Yeah. Avoiding? Yeah. Such as uh, not loading up your root file system. I don't know. I mean, like the things I said, just it, it, initializing variables and just being generally careful in defensive programming, those are things that in any programming language you need say, to kind yeah. of be aware of. Um, Yeah, a couple weeks. Let's see. It's probably it's been a couple months. I actually shot a. I was I was working on an insta installation tool, and this was actually in Python. Okay, but it's a it's a program that installs an in an Ubuntu root file system onto a disk, and then tries to make it boot and reboot into it. Right. And you so, know, like, under root Python is a lot more complex. Huh? Uh, it, it's uh, highly complex uh, assets. Python because I've seen people like trying to make web services with uh, I know hardly as you know, that we are, but uh, like people write web services even much simpler with Python. Yeah, oh yeah, yeah. Um, so I was I, I have a program called Curtain that is an installer for it's a the fast path installer for Ubuntu. Uh, I was running it on an on a system. I thought I was running on a different system and installing to dev SDB. And I was running on, I, on, I ran it on a different system than I thought, and so I actually trashed the the disk underneath that was part of an LVM of the root file system. I forcefully like formatted it while it was while LVM was on it and the root was there, and then put data and then even copied data onto it. I was flat out amazed at how well. I don't even understand it, but. I was able to SSH into the system, and I copied off all of my home and all of everybody else's data. We didn't end up losing any data, oh, but the, the disk was completely gone. I, I had trash, you know, both of all of them. It had a lot of RAM. It had a lot of RAM, yeah, but stuff, cache, yeah, yeah, but, and then it wouldn't reboot, and it, I'm like, yeah. it was it was gone to the world, but. That's good. Yeah. <laughs> so anyway, you can, be, you can be stupid in any language in yeah. any way, you know. Yeah. Under history, uh, what about the, the old shells, Z shell, K shell, T shell? They, um, any of them still around, or are they all gone? Z shells newer. <laughs> yeah, Z, I, Z shell. I think some people use it. I, I don't think you probably see a lot of people programming in Z shell. I think it is a. You know, Unless you're brick. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> as a tactic, as a, as an, I think it's more of a human interface. It has you know goodies than it does programming. I, I don't really think a lot of people would use it from that perspective. I sure I sure wouldn't use corn shell, but yeah, or CSH. I don't know why I'm in here. 
DSH is awesome. I don't know why people. What is the DSH? DSH? Yeah, as a shell. I mean, not as yeah, a, I mean it's a, yeah. I think it's got syntactic stuff. It's it's got a learning curve that I don't need to overcome. <laughs> okay, so thank you very much. Thank you.